I just wanted to do a follow-up video. I had had some questions and comments um, from my last video about the uh, the new calendar, the new dates on it, what when's Rosh Hashanah this year, and uh, so anyway, um, somebody provided a link to a website that has uh, the, the newest dates for the Hebrew calendar. It's called TorahCalendar.com. I'll provide a link to that. And uh, so I went out to that, and I was just kind of looking to see when Rosh Hashanah would be this year. And I also went out on a website called TimeAndDate.com Eclipse. You know, I was I was checking on the the penumbral uh, lunar eclipses, which is you know we just had one yesterday on the 23rd on the first day of Passover. And, um, you know, I know that uh, we knew there were five blood moons in a row on the Hebrew feast days, Pentad, but <laughs> this is pretty amazing. Okay, so I went out and, and I was looking at this um, schedule of eclipses for the penumbral ones. The next penumbral eclipse, lunar eclipse, is scheduled to take place on September 16th and 17th, which according to TorahCalendar.com just happens to be the first day of Sukkot. I mean, wow, the signs in the heavens are yelling, church, look up, your redemption is drawing nigh. I mean, this is just amazing. I, I, anyway, I had to share that with you. Um, please go out and double check, you know, these dates and, and uh, you know, if we got something wrong, fine. But I mean, from what I'm seeing, we have had now Three years in a row, lunar eclipses, Passover, Sukkot, Passover, Sukkot, Passover, Sukkot. There's no doubt in my mind that's unprecedented. Okay, so anyway, um, I hope that blesses you. And again, church, um, let's just keep looking up. 